Hello everyone, my name is Cam and welcome to today's Pez News video. I hope you are all doing well at this time. So we are in the month of July and it is the time where partnership contracts start to expire or partnerships do begin. Atalanta and Napoli's partnerships are underway with Konami, which is displayed now on their partner sections on their websites. However, Napoli's deal with Konami won't properly start until next season because that is when the exclusivity will kick in. Now, speaking about departures, it seems that Schalke's deal with Konami will be coming to an end as the Konami name is removed from the partner section. Now, as an offline player, the Veltins Arena was one of the more unique arenas as the stadium was scanned and replicated very well. So to see this go will be a massive shame. Now, the last topic of today's video is, will PES 2022 be a free-to-play game? Will Konami follow other gaming companies and make their game free to play? Well, on the VGC podcast, one of their members, Andy Robinson, says that Konami will properly go free to play. Take a listen. Um, you know, and I'm, I'm told anything new is going to be, uh, in terms of those two franchises, is going to be uh, years out. But, but you know, Konami, Konami are, flickering, are flickering to life. And there's also going to be new stuff with Pez this year, I hear. Where yeah, they're going to go, they're going to go uh, properly free to play, um, and and really really change it up. Uh, then my take on this is that this is just a rumor at the moment, so take everything you see and hear on this matter with a pinch of salt. But in this day and age, free to play models are very successful business wise. Halo this year will be going free to play, but multiplayer only, whilst the campaign is only available to purchase. Now, Pez has always released Pez Lite at the end of every calendar year. We've not seen anything like this on day one. Well, potentially on day one. If you want to hear more on this story going forward, I would recommend following VGC on Twitter to keep up to date. Or if you are interested in the coverage, I myself will keep you guys up to date. So thank you to everyone who has watched today's short Pez News video. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. And if you are interested in the latest news, rumors, and speculation for Pro Evolution Soccer, consider subscribing to the channel for your news in a short and informative way. Also, if you have Discord, Come and join over 100 members in my Pez Discord server. It will be great to see you there. Again, my name is Cam. Take care, and I will see you all in the next one.